So you guys created a new inventory vehicle management software tool. Is that what we're doing right now? So this is vehicle appraising as well? It is. Here at NADA, we're launching the CDK vehicle inventory suite. From the used inventory dashboard here, I'm going to go in and I'm going to say, I got a Nissan Murano. In the center of the screen here, I've got the scatter view of the market. Okay. So I can see kind of the goalposts here on my mileage range. And what this is going to do is dynamically adjust the distance from me based on getting a large enough sample size of this vehicle. If we're dealing with a more common vehicle, this radius will tighten down. But if I'm trading in a Corvette Z06, it'll go out. And I'm out. And, yeah, but you can also do it manually where you yeah. can come in and change that. These are all showing us particular vehicles and where those listings are coming from. And if I want to take a look at one of these, I can click right into that and I can see that selected vehicle. And I can also get into seeing things like the price history and the movement on it. Yeah, that's awesome. So this is basically effectively showing you guys where the car is going in the future of a market. So if you're buying a car, let's say market dipping, this will give you guys a future into the value of the vehicle if you're buying this car in June and you're not maybe ACVing the car right with the correct costs and it pricing it correctly, this will kind of tell you to maybe be careful, don't buy this car, market's going down in 30, 60 days. So. And a lot of times in your work, when you're talking to somebody that's trying to sell you a car or they're telling you, well, hey, I'm looking at this car somewhere else, you've got that information too, right at yeah. your fingertips so you can see what you're competing well, against. Well, well, consumers just don't know the amount of data that we have, they right. just think we price a car up for blah, whatever. So this green line is basically telling you where all these cars is selling at like that's actually cool because like oh i'm about to buy this car what are they selling for so you have to look but here they're pretty much telling you this is a lot faster it's all about like speed when you're buying is there a section where you could put it that has caps or not i don't believe so no it's important you guys should look into that